Hi guys and welcome to Food Reviewing UK. My name is Nathan Peterson. Summer is upon us and uh, we are shortly going to be seeing, I'm sure, a wide variety of novelty ice creams and drinks and things like that to capitalise on the hot sunny days. First one that I'm going to be reviewing this summer is this, eight sweet shop, well I'm not going to review all eight, sweet shop ice lollies from Tesco, not Tesco's because that winds up Michael Jameson. I find it irritating when people refer to things like Wagamamas. It's not Wagamamas, it's Wagamama. You don't say Nando's is. You don't say Nando's is, Wagamamas. <laughs> These look like, obviously I haven't tried them yet, they look like mini milks, is that what they're called? Which I'm not necessarily a massive fan of. However, these look pretty quirky. I'm going to start with, I think, bubble gum. There you go. Nice blue and white. They look good. I'll give them that. I like the dual colours. Quite cool. Rather than just having a blue one, give it two different flavours. Colours even. It's two different flavours, isn't it? Oh, is it? Oh, sorry, marshmallow and blue, 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 glum, blue, blue, glum. I basically don't know what I'm doing. Can't wait for all the um, penis sucking jokes in the comments below. It's <laughs> definitely got a not an authentic marshmallow taste, but that sort of fake. I mean, marshmallows are fake, but that sort of if you got marshmallow sweet. I'm not quite sure. If that is a mini milk, but I think that's slightly more like, I don't know if you can see the crystallising in there. I think that's more like a lolly than a sort of a milky ice cream thing. Mm-hmm. That is a very mild bubblegum flavour. Yeah, it's definitely sort of, actually saying that, it is definitely sort of mini milk texture. It's definitely got that sort of milkiness in the flavour. It's not bad. As I say, the fact that I'm not a mini milk fan is always going to mean it's going to be on an uphill battle. Um, but definitely can get the two flavours, the, the, the bubblegum and the, uh, the marshmallow. For me, probably looking at a uh, middle of the road three. I'm now going to step it up a gear, go hardcore with the marshmallow and the uh, candy floss. I need to produce on this video apparently. Well, stop looking at me for answers. I'm saying I do because I don't know what I... I'm saying, oh, this is a little bit nicer. The marshmallow is sort of influenced. You still get that sort of flavour, but it's this bit of sucking this bit of the marshmallow is different to sucking that bit of the marshmallow. You can sort of taste a bit more sweetness. All the sucking. All the sucking. All the time. Yeah, I can. I was going to say, I'm not sure that I could get that as candy floss. It was sort of more of a sort of a fruity, raspberry sort of sweetness. But actually, it does come through a little bit. Definitely nicer. A little bit, probably a little bit sweeter than the bubblegum one. Uh, I think, yeah, I definitely prefer this one to the bubblegum one. I'll probably give this one a, it's still, for one, it's still only probably a high three stars. Not fe fully feeling these. Good job I didn't buy them for you then. Good job you didn't buy them for me then. <laughs> um, yeah. Have you tried these? Do these interest you? What other what other flavours would you like to see? I mean, they say sweet shop ice lollies. I mean, I'd candy. Like, I'd like rhubarb and custard. Well, as I was gonna say, candy floss is hardly something I would consider to be a sweet shop. Bubble gum, yeah, I guess. Marshmallow, I guess. But candy floss is a bit of an odd one. Like if someone said sweet shop, anything. They, they aren't necessarily the flavours I'd be thinking of. I would be thinking of lemon sherbets, rhubarb and custard, cola cubes. Um, Pear drops. Yeah, things like that. Even uh, uh, bananas and shrimps and things like that. These aren't necessarily... Ooh, remember those chocolate bananas? Maybe we could get like a chocolate banana flavour. There you go, Tesco's. Step up your game. Um, yeah, not bad though. So, anyway. Yeah. Uh, thank you all for watching. Please like down here I think it is, like down here, and then comment down right down there and share us with your friends. See you later, bye. Oh hi sweet pea! 
I'm like, yeah, I might be completely wrong. I might be just throwing out discounts that they're going to have to. I might be writing checks that their ass can't catch. Catch. Ruin that fucking sentence. I might be ruin. Oh, I might be ruining. Oh, fucking hell. I might be writing catch. I. Why is the sentence? Fact. 